guys, so I'm gonna play uh Humphrey nineteen sixty-eight. This time I'm gonna play nineteen sixty-eight again, but this time I'm gonna play Hubert Humphrey. So previously I've already read out this part. Uh so yeah, so Hubert H. Humphrey, uh, for years, Humphrey has been seen as Johnson's natural successor. This both helped and hurt him in the bitter nomination struggle. Humphrey is fighting a war on many fronts. He must present a clear case for liberal ideals, bring back the activist wing of the party, head off of Wallace's efforts, and still succeed in his primary task of defeating the odious Nixon. So, yeah, you got a few selections, so this is the original one, uh, Ed Muskie. Muskie is a senator from Maine, and although he has a low national profile, he could help Humphrey solidify his base and carry the northeastern states. By going with Muskie, Humphrey would probably be riding off most of the south and would also be giving uh, Nixon an opening among moderate voters. So, it's Ted Kennedy, a younger brother to John and Robert Kennedy, and a staunch liberal. Ted Kennedy would be a choice if Humphrey wished to reconcile with the liberal and anti-war wing of the party. Uh, Kennedy will not accept the nomination, however, unless Humphrey repudiates the hawkish policies of President Johnson. This could cause, cause problems with moderates and, more importantly, with the Democratic establishment. Now, I'm not sure about Kennedy. I've tried uh, test games with Muskie and Connolly, and I've also done Harris before, but I don't know. I don't think Kennedy, from this bio, I don't think he'd be good because Texas wouldn't be in play. Uh, well, it sort of would, but like Texas would kind of be gone if we select him. So, yeah, I don't know if I would pick him. I'd figure he, he probably would be the best because he's a Kennedy, but apparently, I, I don't entirely know. I might do like a, like a, like a, like a no commentary video where I play as like Humphrey Kennedy or something, but John Connolly, uh, he was the governor of uh, Texas who was infamously wounded in the Kennedy assassination. He would reinforce a moderate image, help to deliver Texas to the ticket, and dampen the appeal of Wallace. Elsewhere, to all but the most hardline segregationists, however, the anti-war liberal wing of the party will surely recoil at this selection. Uh, Fred Harris, he's a Democrat from Oklahoma. He could help his party make a play for some of the southern states without alienating its liberal wing. Harris will add very little to the campaign if he fails to deliver some states in the South at his young age, 37 years old. It could be alarming to some voters. Yeah, the South would sort of be, like, you'll get Texas even with Muskie, so, like, I don't know about these guys. Again, I don't know. I used to play as Harris. I used to play as, because I thought I'd be, like, good sectional. Like, good sectionally and, like, ideologic, ideologically, but, uh, yeah, I don't know. Harris isn't very enth enthusiastic running mate. I'm not sure. I'm just gonna go with Muskie, uh, with this, so, the original one, so. Here we go. So, when you're playing this, immediately Nixon is completely destroying you, but this will change drastically, so. This is very important, what you say about your convention speech. Uh, the first one is the absolute best one. Defense, you want to call for a truce and everything. The second option um, is, I think that's okay too. It's not as good as the first one. Third one, I think, is too leftist. Uh, fourth one is too... I mean, you're being, is the worst one. You're being ignorant towards it. So, you do first one. Uh, so, yeah, the first one's pretty good. Actually, there's two you can pick. I'm not sure. 
I picked the fourth one because most people like the Great Society. They're either moderate on it or they're, uh, yeah, it's like slightly opposed. And it's about ending Vietnam. The other, uh, focus on my biography. I don't know about. Yeah, you don't want to pick the Johnson because Johnson's extremely unpopular. You don't want to pick the first, uh, Johnson administration, you know. So I just pick this one. And the first state, uh, I will be going to California. So, because uh, that gets com really competitive later. So, my overall position on Vietnam, you want to say we should stop bombing we should stop bombing Vietnam. Uh, you do not want to pick the second one. Absolutely do not. Uh, fourth one is too dovish. And the first one is just weak. You know, that's what I think that's what originally Humphrey did. But, uh, this one is an RNG event. So yeah, I'll just I'll just pause the game. Just one sec. Uh, I decided I'm just gonna go with this one. This one's a good. There's a better option, but um, I'm just not in the mood to play around with this stupid ass RNG. So this option's pretty good. You, the other one, the worst option you can get here is Nixon. Uh, not doing like doing better than he did, but this is also this is the okay option. You still gain momentum here. So. I go back to California. Uh, this one I think I'll do the first one. I talk about integration. Yeah, stain of yeah, yeah, that's the one. Yeah, don't pick the other ones. Uh, talk about yourself here, sort of. I always go to California. You're not gonna win the state in the South. You're not gonna. There's no point in going there. So uh, I'll just run my. I don't care. Uh, shit, Nixon's leading there now. I commend this piece of legislation. You want to be center left on everything except for the war. You want to be well. Yeah, you want to be center left on everything. That's how really you should try to do it. Uh, yeah, outstanding. The other ones are garbage. Outstanding. Um, yeah, say local matter. The other one about legal segregation that that makes that makes it look like. Like, you're not decisive, and the second one you absolutely do not want to do, uh, fourth one is, yeah, it's too far left. Uh, California. Oh, yeah, and you know the Nixon 1960 with Rockefeller? I did the exact same thing, and somehow I got, like, a way better result. I got all the South, and I got, like, I only lost the South of Massachusetts again with the answers that I did in that video. So yeah, it was just for some reason I really bad RNG for some reason. But anyway, uh, uh, yeah, just say he's anti-union and regressive. Uh, yeah, policing, pre you know, you don't want to talk about brutality. Actually, I should have went to Illinois. That's where... Oh, no, actually, no, that's okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, just disavow it. Okay. Uh, yeah, honorable peace. You want to be like Nixon talking about peace, like in our world. You want to be talking about making a peace agreement.
Okay, I think, yeah, California's good now. So now I have to concentrate on the central. So, uh, yeah, Missouri. Yeah, long-term peace agreement. The fourth one, um, is, two is anti-Israel, and that hurts you a lot, so... Uh, to say he's a dem, uh, why anybody could think he's a Democrat, uh, oh, no, we're, we're, okay, we're slipping, uh, the war on poverty, yeah, law and war, yeah, yeah, you also want to talk a bit about law and order, but don't go overboard with it, uh, Yeah, both sides. I'm actually leading. I think this is the first time I've led in Arkansas. I, I, they, that usually goes to Wallace. It's probably gonna go to Wallace again. I, I bet. But, um. Actually, it's Florida. Florida's sort of close. I won't go there though. I'll go to Missouri. Uh, yeah, comp also comprehensive peace. Uh, I don't know if the third one's good or not, but I know the first one's good. Missouri. Uh, world without nuclear weapons. I think. It's a bit extreme, but you want to go uh, control of nuclear weapons. And... Yeah, agreements. You want agreements. So you, you know, sort of weird. You kind of want to copy Nixon a bit, like, with some, with some stuff here. You want to kind of copy Nixon. It's just... It's a bit strange, but that's, that's kind of how you win. See, even, like, I don't need Connolly or anything. I'm still doing okay. I don't even need the South anyway. Uh, yeah, Kentucky, yeah, okay. Uh, yeah. American Hero. Uh, yeah, do everything to defend it. This is an RNG question. I gotta pause it. One sec. Okay, yeah, I got the first try. So yeah, uh, yeah, Nixon's, uh, interfering with the peace agreement, but. Anyway, so. Yeah, I I pick Muskie because I you just focus on the north. There's no point in doing the south. I tried to do Connolly. I was trying to do like reform the New Deal coalition, and I I won with them, but it was closer. So yeah, that's good. I won Kentucky. That's good. Ohio, that's good. Yeah, Missouri. There we go. So, the happy warrior rises. Uh, despite a climate of chaos and a split in the Democratic Party, you've beaten back the opposition and secured a third term for the Democrats. Johnson breathes a sigh of relief after this, and poor Nixon is once again a loser. The shock of pundits countrywide, you beat Nixon and Wallace handily. The bombing halt in your inspiring words compared to Nixon must have won it for you. Your first course of action is to fix what Johnson caused. Vietnam and the riots need to be dealt with. Johnson might not like how you deal with it, but this is your administration, and you'll deal with it the way you do. 
act quickly, or you might just become as unpopular as Johnson. So yeah, I want a very good victory. This is, I think this is always the map you'll get. I don't know if the Nevada might, no. No, Nevada, Nevada, I think always stays. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is always the map you'll get. Like on normal. Yeah, so... Yeah, this... So yeah, just pick uh, Muskie as your VP and just... Kind of go center left. Like, get some ideas from Nixon and his original campaign. And then that's how you win. So... Hope you guys enjoy this video. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe. I'm gonna play uh, Super Mario Bros. in a sec. Uh, so yeah, the next campaign trail I'll do. I'm gonna do Trump uh, 2016 because I know a there's a guaranteed way I found where you could win that. I found a guide, and there's a literal guaranteed way. Like, every single time you win. So, anyway, I'll, I'll see you guys later.